Hi guys and welcome to another Nets Tool Talk video. In today's video, we're getting off the power tools, drills and stuff like that, whatever. Uh, and we have a carpet cleaner to do a video about, to talk about. So this is Bissell, I think it's Power Clean, it's too long of a name. Bissell Power Clean Max Carpet Shampoo. So it's quite a long name. The model number 3112F and this unit will set you back around $445 in Australia that's depending is it on a sale or not which day you got there if you've been lucky with some prices and stuff but that's roughly the price that you're gonna pay now firstly I'm just reading over the phone because there's so many stats about it firstly I'm gonna tell you what you get in a box. So in a box, you'll get a shampoo as is with quite a long cord. Um, you'll get two in one crevice tool and a tough stain tool. I don't have those things with me, but you can pretty much get a, so as it is now, you use it on the carpets and rugs, but you can also use it, you get a, like a hose, like on a vacuum cleaner with a nozzle and a suction tool and you can use it on your car seats and stuff you can clean the car seats you can clean some smaller stuff with it it gets attached on the tool um, so that's those things and you get two of those um, formulas you get small small uh, pots maybe two three hundred mil um, they call it a trial size it's more or less if you when you buy the thing you walk out from the store get home so you can start cleaning rather than you have to buy something right away but it's not gonna last you long anyways so that's what the thing does now a couple of more things about it as you see it it's not a massive unit but it's not small as well weighs a couple of kilos maybe six seven kilos doesn't really weigh that much uh, the top tank is where you fill the clean water with the solution so you just pull it up undo the screw, undo the cap, and at the back of it here will tell you formula and water. And you can put maximum 60 degrees or 140 Fahrenheit temperature of the water. So you're pretty much safe off the tap, go to the full hot, let it run to get the full, full hot water, fill it in and just put the rest of the thing of the solution and you'll be safe to go. Don't put boiling water. So that's the top tank. The bottom tank right here is gonna be just gonna hold it. This is gonna be your dirty water. So it'll come from the bottom, comes it comes up and it fills here. Now it does not fill a lot. Yep, so when it gets up to here, it's full because it needs the air on top to breathe. How do you empty it? Just lift this cap, empty it, close it, tilt the unit to the back, lock this in, and you are ready to go. Also, I've tilted the thing twice and I haven't shown you how to do it. This is made standing up. I'm not gonna stand up, I'm just gonna do it like this. With your foot, just press the Press the lever, you tilt it like that, and then you work, okay? Right at the back of the cleaner, there's a on, on and off button. That's how you turn it on and off. On the right side of the cleaner, you've got a lever here. Up is deep clean, down is express clean. What does that mean? Now, when you put the thing, when you put a thing in an express clean and you press the trigger, the nozzle at the front is not gonna squirt that much water in a solution. It's gonna squirt just enough just to get the surface a little bit wet and it'll be sucking, but you'll notice even at the front here where it's sucking, there's not much coming out. When you put it in a deep clean and in a, in a quick clean, you're gonna, your solution is gonna last much longer. Um, when you put it in a deep clean, your water when you press the nozzle is gonna be coming out much much more which is gonna be soaking up the rug or the carpet much more and 
of course it's going to be sucking out more of the dirt and the debris and whatnot out of it. Okay. So what I want to do now is I'm going to get some water and a solution in it and I'll show you here. This is quite a dirty spot of the carpet and I'll show you. But before I do that, I'm going to unroll the cord and we'll measure the cord. It doesn't say, I haven't found anyway how long it is, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, you got around seven and a half meters, roughly. Seven and a half to eight meters. Because that measurement is not spot on, but it's very close to a meter. So between seven and eight meters of cord you have, which is, to be honest, quite, quite a long cord. Okay, so I've just filled up the tank with hot water. I haven't gone all the way to the top because for the purpose of the video I have no need for. Um, and I put some of this solution. This is what solution will look like when you get it in the box when you purchase the cleaner itself. It's 236 mil small bottles. Um, this is honestly I think maybe two, two or three of these tanks and you're gonna go through this bottle um, and to buy more solution I think it's around $25. Not that I think I know it's around $25 because I've bought it multiple times for a half a liter bottle. So that's more cost effective than buying these small ones. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna plug it in and we're gonna try it on a quick clean and then we're gonna try it on a deep clean. So, get in, okay. Now, as I said, to get the thing started, just move the cord, to get the thing tilted, not started, your foot there, lean it backwards, and now you are ready to operate. But it's not gonna do anything until you turn it on. So this might be a little bit loud. We're going to go on a quick clean. I don't know if you can see here, but there's very little being sucked up. And you can tell by the rug, it's not getting wet much. Okay? By the carpet. Now I'm gonna flip it to deep clean. And just keep, the, keep your eyes on the rug and you'll see. Immediately it starts getting different color. And you can also see at the front, right here, how much it's sucking up, how much water and the solution is coming out. So let's just do this small section. And honestly, I prefer it doing backwards because then it squirts, scrubs, and it sucks it up in one motion. It's kind of made to be, designed to be used backwards, going backwards. This is the dirtiest spot by far.
and then once you're done with it, just go a few times over it without a trigger squeeze, just to pull out as much of that water that you can, and then like that, if you do that, your um, carpets or rugs, whatever you're cleaning, it's gonna get dry much quicker. Okay, there we go. It's a quick demo. Also, another thing is, right here, you lift, and then I think you can remove this. Yep, you can remove the front to be able to clean the roller easier. And at the, on the bottom, you're gonna have the roller. At the front here is where it sucks, and right there at the back is where it sprays. So that's why I say when you're going backwards, First it sprays, it agitates, and then it sucks it up. That's why it's ideal to do it like that. You can also go forward and just spray it, and then agitate after, but like this you do it all in one motion. And let's see at the condition of the water that we've pulled out. So that's what it looks like from this two minutes pass. Ideally, you want to do it up until there's no more brown, but you might be here alone all day. Because it takes a lot of solution and a lot of back and forth until it gets fully, fully clean. So guys, that's it. A quick video about a Bissell power cleaner. Um, we love it. We use it on the carpets. We use it at, with a crevice tool. Um, for the cars and stuff. I also got another Bissell, I think Spot Clean Turbo it's called. That's more of a smaller unit, like a vacuum cleaner, standard size vacuum cleaners for cars and stuff, especially for cars, it's good. Uh, so I might make a video about that one soon. When the spring comes, I usually do spring cleaning of the car, so. Anyways, 440 to 450, roughly AUD. Um, it's a very cheap in, and inexpensive unit to buy. If you go to Bunnings to hire one of these things, you're gonna pay, I don't know, $30, $40 a day, plus you gotta pay the bond, you gotta buy the solutions, this, that, and then it's just going there, coming back, then you go to Bunnings that it's not available in that Bunnings, go to the next one. Um, like this, it's not a expensive, expensive machine if you got the carpets in your house. I think it's well worth it, the purchase. Um, guys, thank you for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. 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 Anyways, also, by the way, all the products that I review now, the tools, whatever, I put links to purchase them in the description. So, again, bye. Ciao.